Welcome back to Icarus Prospectors, SH Gaming 599. Guys, for today, we're going to do a solo guide on the Spirit Level Survey Mission. So let's go, let's claim this. As usual, I will be bringing my Dapner module, my axe, my pickaxe, and my knife. So guys, I'll see you guys on the other side. Alright, so as usual, make sure to... Put your stuff right where they belong. Rearrange your inventory if necessary. There we go. I'm done with this. So now, let me mark my place where we need to go. And let's drop. There we go. I honestly don't have a bow right now, which is sad, but you know, it's fine. Okay, so we need to go this way. Let's go this way. Oh, good lord. I love this place. <laughs> this place is so beautiful. I uh, I know there's a cave right over there. That's the one of the best cave in the game. Their research teams think they can predict where it forms. Yeah, yeah. But they need more geologic data. Cool. I'll I'll, I'll do that. GPR stations to take readings. They need line of sight. So if terrain's too low, you'll need to build them platforms so they can connect. Yes, yes, for sure, for sure. Anyways, um, yeah, just uh, just grab the stuff, get yourself a bow, get yourself a couple of um, buffs. As you can see over here, this is a good buff to get in the beginning. It doesn't cost anything, and it's very good to get. So, yeah, just make your way to, um, to that marker. Okay, so here we are at the marker. We'll just get rid of him. Also, I made a, made a bow, as you can see. And also, we're going to make a couple of those bone arrows, which are way better than stone arrows. So... Ouch. I hate it. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. Yeah, so... Uh, yeah, I was quite lucky to get these two wolves. Um... Uh, before actually, I mean not not here right now. Uh, so let's get the first scanner. So there's a there's two scanners. As you can see, there's two scanners in here, but I think we should be able to just um, get it done with one scanner. I'll show you guys how if if it if it works because it did when I was trying solo. But anyways, I'll bring you guys back to my next. Uh, basically, open your map. Okay, so here we are. This is where we need to go. Let's put a marker over here. So let's I'll meet you guys right over here. Just a small note, guys. Um, I was making my way to my location and uh, there's a elephant over here. So what you can, can do if you need of levels, I don't. But if you need a level, make sure to kill the elephant. It gives a tons and tons amount of XP, like 30k or something or something like that. It is... a uh, awesome way to level up so yeah make sure to kill it if you're in need of levels all right guys so here we are we made it uh so what you need to do is you you need to build a um something whatever you want uh it has to go upstairs and you need to uh put your scanner in that bubble in that sphere that you can see uh you have two spheres to build that's why you have two scanners but i think we'll be we'll be able to manage with one so what you can do, there's a actual cave here nearby. Here. So let me show you guys the location of this cave. It's right here. Can I? Thank you. <laughs> so it's right here. This cave will, uh, it has tons of ores and all the good stuff. Let me make a torch so you guys can see. Torch. No, that's a, yep, that's torch. Put you here. Let's put you zero. Okay, no, let's not smack anything. So as you can see, there's a couple of ores, and obviously there's uh, these uh, stupid bugs. Yikes! 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 Let me just kill. Let me just get rid of them. Come on, spawn. Thank you. And okay, Where are you? Two. Thank you. And give me my arrows back. I need my arrows. Give me my arrows. Arrows are... Yeah, there's another one. There we go. Awesome. And not sure if there's an... Yeah, there's more. Okay, fine. Just be careful not to um, 
be here too long otherwise you get pneumonia but yeah the idea is to get to these um somehow to these uh, spheres and uh, the way i want to do this is i will be making these let me show you guys there pillars stone well beams stone beams so that's where how we're going to um to manage to get upstairs and we'll place a the scanner on top of one of these beams i believe it's 10 or 11 i'll show you guys that so what i'll do i'll mine everything in here and make a um already made a um crafting bench and i'll make a obviously a stone forge uh, and then an anvil and then make some nails to make those all the good stuff you know so i'll bring you guys back once i'm already installed all right guys welcome back so here we go so i got all the stuffs with me i what i did basically made him um a crafting bench made myself a stone furnace also an anvil which allowed me to make these uh, nails which is um, very very nice i mined a couple of iron nodes i mean i haven't touched copper or anything else and yeah so here we are with um everything i got 11 stone beams uh you know what i'm like nothing 11 i can and whatever i shall here we go and okay so yeah now what we can do is um we, i'll do this one first what is that zebra okay i lost and also need to repair this bad boy what you need again to repair you need sticks uh, later it's fine okay so here just go underneath it just check where we, you know here should be fine is this underneath yeah this should be good and from here just you know start Placing down pillars here. This is good, right? That should be good. Not sure. Uh, yeah, here, here -ish, somewhere. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> I want here. Oh my god, this is annoying. Uh, here, yeah, that's it. There we go. This should be good. Okay. So from there, you can just, you know, uh, that was my bad. Let's get rid of this one. Make yourself go to the top. And for that, you will need ladders already made, crafted ladders. So you can, I'll place my ladders. Um, yeah, sure, this, this is fine. Here is fine. So let's go. I don't know if six is enough. I think not. Okay and seven just be careful not to uh there and is this enough i'm not sure <laughs> we'll see uh go down please there six uh, i think i'll need a couple more ladders yeah definitely a couple more ladders okay uh, let's go downstairs. Uh, okay, so what do you need for ladders? Ladders, wood and fiber. Okay, uh, I'll be right back. I'll go and get my, a couple more ladders. Welcome back, guys. So, here we are to the first location. I had to move uh, the pillars uh, a bit back into the water a bit over here. So, yeah, just go down and look where, like, if you put like the pillar around here you should be able to go directly to the um the sphere but yeah i mean this is this is gonna work fine as well uh let's uh let's see actually so from here you're gonna go on top and from here there we go we are in the sphere go back a bit g let's place it here And here we go. So, oh, oh my God. Ooh, careful, careful. Oh boy. That got really, really not good. All right. So once the first transmission, like, as you can see on the left side, the transmit, uh, transmit uh, geodata look from location Zulu is checked. So now we need to go to the second location, as you can see over there. So let's go there. 
just be careful not to drop to our fall to our death <laughs> also make sure to have a couple of not a couple sorry i mean um make sure to have a bad roll going in the cave just in case something went wrong and you know we die uh, I, like I said, I did die, as you can see on my top left bar. My XP is, uh, that's why you're, we have, again, these, uh, friendly, uh, neighbors. Because I did die, I, <laughs> and then I had that debuff. Oh my god, please leave me alone for, there, one and two, thank you very much. Let's go out, come back in. There should be another one. No? There. Two. Give me my arrows back. One. Two. Give me my arrows back, please. I need those. Let's grab you. Oops. There. And this guy took all my arrows. Not cool. Not cool, dude. <laughs> yeah, so make sure you get uh, a bad roll going over here. Uh, yeah, I do want to go into the cave because I needed to get my other... Pillars. There. I did make uh, more pillars. I mean, I didn't know what to do with the iron. So yeah, here we are <laughs> with more pillars. Um, all right, cool. So now the second location is right next to it, which is very, very nice. And here we go. Okay. So this should be good here. Uh, let's hope it is. Um, no, I don't think so. Okay, I think we got it over here. This one, this one should be a good one. So yeah, let's uh, let's complete this up. Six. There we go. Here, here, here. Okay, let's go upstairs. And can I place it? Thank you. There, six, seven, careful, careful, not to drop, careful, I need to go back to my, uh, yep, there we go, and this is good enough, there we go, it is, all right, so here we can place down the last, but not least, scanner, boom, here we go guys so yeah you can just pick up one like the the uh, the same scanner to do this mission i mean it's quite simple both locations are right next to each other i think this might get patched i'm not sure but uh on this date i mean we are in 20 january 17 2022 so i'm not sure if this is gonna get patched but you can just pick up your scanner and yeah that's it <laughs> as easy as simple as that this mission is very very easy i mean the uh, the only issue that you have to build is the um is the stone uh, stone uh, pillars beam if you will that's the only issue otherwise the rest is quite simple nothing like you know there's like dangers but nothing too uh too critical for you yeah just i mean uh, hyenas or jaguars or other stuff like that but that's about it and what's even better is that you have a cave right next to uh the location it's right over here which is awesome this game i mine white like uh maybe like five or six node and i was able to easily easily gain everything i needed to build like uh I didn't even took any, anything from that pillar. Uh, just make sure that you get fiber from the starting area where you are here. From here, make sure you get the at least get the um, the fibers because fiber is scarce in here. You won't be able to find much fiber. That's the only annoying part. Otherwise, it's uh, this mission is quite fun. It was uh, nice, uh, nice. Uh, yeah, it was pretty nice. Uh, I'll see you guys near the drop pod. Hey guys. Um, I will be t showing you guys the way back home because it might be confusing a bit sometimes uh, depending on where you are. So what I did, I came back from here and I will be hogging this thing to go back and then I'll hop onto this one. Uh, let me show you guys that. So like you said, I was coming from there, came all the way here and then we're going up to this stream over here 
and from there you can either ladder your way up i mean that's fine as well i mean i'm just showing one way to to get upstairs so from here all you gotta do is look at your left you can go from there uh but uh, yeah there was danger so that's why i didn't <laughs> Or you can go from here as well, but as you can see, there's going to be tons of blockage. What I do... What, oh my god, there's so much weather here. So what I did, I came over here. From here, I went up since there was dangers down the road over there. So yeah, and awesome, we got a, um, a storm going. Awesome, great, good news. So, uh, <laughs> and you're going for me, aren't you? Come for me? No? No? Wow, you you took lots of shots, buddy. Anyways, uh, so yeah, I'll, uh, I'll meet you guys back home, uh, back to the drop pod. All right, guys, here we are to the drop pod. Just some nice uh, tips and tricks, guys. First of all, before heading to the desert biome, make sure to get all the fibers that you can because. Uh, it is going to be needed a lot. Um, building anything, I mean, that's fine. Um, also, if you can get already uh, some sort of uh, food, for example, the carrots or the melons, uh, that's very, very nice to get in the beginning. So while you're heading to the des desert biome, just grab those because they will become, they will come in handy when you're at the... Um, cave there you can drop down a uh, campfire and yeah cook those carrots or and uh, those melons with your uh, with your meat so you can get like three buffs going at all time which is so great i mean it just saves it adds more health it adds more stamina it it's just awesome amazing anyways um Guys, if you enjoyed this guide, make sure to smash that like button for me, please. If you're new, do subscribe to the channel for more of these missions. Solo guide, SH Gaming 599. Till next time, guys.